Prayers for favor in court case. If you have a court case, if you are innocent, as you pray with me in faith, believe that your court case will be settled in your favor and dismissed. We have been winning lots of court cases using the scripture, Jeremiah 20, 11, where God said that he is with you like a mighty, terrible one. Therefore, those who arise up to persecute you, they will stumble. Those who rise up to persecute you, they will not prosper. Their everlasting confusion will never be forgotten. Pray with me in faith. And for those, you might have made a mistake. Perhaps you are guilty. But what you, it's important for you to understand, even though you are guilty, God is a God of mercy. You must repent, take responsibility, own up to your action, own up to whatever wrong you have done or er erroneous action. And say, Lord, you are a God of mercy. Remember now, Lord, not the sins of my youth. Ask him not to remember the sins of your youth. Say, according to Psalms 25, verse 7, remember not the sins of my youth, Lord, the errors of my youth, nor the transgression. According to your mercy, remember me for your goodness sake. So God will remember you because of mercy. So I'm going to repent with you, pray with you for anywhere you have erred, that God will remember you and that God will extend mercy. Father, those who are praying with me, I ask you to extend mercy, mercy to them, Lord. Be merciful unto them. And as they pray with me, Father, we declare that this court case this court battle, maybe they are incarcerated, a mother that found this and is crying over a son or a daughter. Father, we pray for mercy. We pray for mercy. Lord, we take full responsibility for those that have sinned and erred, even come against the law. Lord, we ask you for mercy. You are a God of mercy, a God of favor, and a God of love. So as they pray, Holy Spirit, we ask that you send your angel even now to deliver them. As they go to court, I ask that you show up with them, that they will know you are God, and that, Lord, they will testify in the name of Jesus. Pray with me in faith. Plead their cause, O God, O Lord. Thri strive with them that strive with them. Fight against them that fight against them, O Lord. Take hold of shield and bottle and stand up for their help. Oh, Lord, I ask that you will draw out your spear and stop the way against them that persecute them. Say unto their soul, I am your salvation. Let them be confounded and put to shame that seek after their soul. Let them be turned back and brought to confusion that devised their hurt in the name of Jesus. Lord, hear them in the day of trouble. Let the name of the Lord God defend them. May the Lord God send help from the sanctuary and strengthen them out of Zion. Oh Lord, remember all their gifts. Remember all their sacrifices and their prayers. Let their accept, Father, their prayers tonight, today. Accept their sacrifices. May you grant all the desires of their heart. Make all their plans succeed. May the Lord you answer them. And may they shout for joy because of victory. Father, raise a victory banner over them even as they pray in the name of Jesus. Father, I pray even for that mother that is struggling with this court situation for their children. And so, Father, I pray in the name of Jesus that you said, though hands join in hands, the wicked will not go unpunished, but the seed of the righteous, the righteous children, the children who belong to righteous parents. Father, you declare that they shall be delivered. I declare over you that you shall be delivered in the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you that you are with them like a mighty, terrible one. Therefore, their persecutors shall stumble. They shall not prevail. They shall greatly be ashamed, for they shall not prosper. Their everlasting confusion shall never be forgotten. Lord, you are the righteous judge. So, Lord, I ask that you will execute righteous judgment, righteous justice on their behalf in the name of Jesus, according to Psalms 103, verse 6. 
Lord, like Esther found favor before the king, so let them found favor before the judge in the judicial system. Let them found divine favor, mighty God, I ask. We declare the charges dropped in the name of Jesus. We dropped every charge as kingdom legislature. We pray with them and we declare the charges dropped. Lord, let your judgment and righteousness be true in their lives and in their situation in the name of Jesus. Lord, subdue the people, subdue the judicial system, the nation under their feet. Oh Lord, I say, God, we thank you, mighty God, that you rule in the affairs of men. So rule in their situation in the name of Jesus. Oh God, for we put our trust in you. Therefore, we will not be afraid what man can do unto. Let them not be afraid what man can do unto them. But let them stand and rise up in faith in the name of Jesus, declaring victory. I want you to begin to declare victory with me. Say victory in the court. As I show up, I will have favor with the judge. As I show up, I am increasing in wisdom and statue. I am increasing in favor with God and man. I'm increasing with favor with the judge. I am increasing with favor with those who rise up to, to, to prosecute me in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, Lord, I pray that you beat down their enemies. My God, plague those who hate them, those who rise up against them, to charge them, almighty God, even to defame their name. In the name of Jesus, let them be persecuted. Let them be put to shame. Oh, my God, I pray you plague those who hate them in the name of Jesus. Lord, I declare over your people, those that are praying with me, that God, you will prepare a table before them in the presence of their enemies. Lord, I thank you that your justice and your judgment will rule in their favor in the name of Jesus. Lord, recompense tribulation to those who trouble them. Recompense tribulation to those who trouble them. I declare that the Lord will recompense and repay vengeance on your behalf. Recompense, mighty God. I declare vengeance on your behalf. Lord, extend your scepter of righteousness and rule in their favor in the name of Jesus. I declare clear uh, that your court case be overturned. I overturn man's rule. I overturn man's rule. Uh, and I declare that God will rule in your favor in Jesus name. Uh, in Jesus name let man's rule be overturned. Uh, in the name of Jesus we settle this court case. We settle it uh, in your favor right now in the name of Jesus. Uh, Lord let there be divine substitution uh, that every gallus that is set for them. Let those who set the gallows for them, they will hang on the same gallows. Those who are accusing them, my God, the pit that they set for them, they will fall in their own pit in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, I pray that you will turn the counsel of every conspirators, those who conspire against them, turn their counsel into foolishness, frustrate the tokens of the liars, those who lie against them, frustrate their their tokens. Uh, frustrate them in the name of Jesus. Make diviners mad. Uh, turn every wise man backward that uh, rise up against them. Uh, make their knowledge be foolish in the name of Jesus. Uh, I declare, Father, in the name of Jesus, that God, you will arise. Uh, you will arise, my God, and let their enemies be scattered. Uh, arise, my God, and let them be scattered in utmost confusion uh, that turn up against them in the name of Jesus. Uh, Father, you said you turn the hearts of the king. The hearts of the king's heart is in the hand of the Lord. The judge's heart is in your hand. So God, turn it to settle, Almighty oh God, this case in their favor. Turn the heart of the judge, my God. Oh God, to favor them in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, turn, mighty God, turn this case in their favor. We declare a divine settlement. We declare a divine divine favor in the name of Jesus. Uh, let those who are praying with me, let them shout joys of victory. Uh, oh God, even those who are hurting because of this court case, uh, court battle. 
I pray in the name of Jesus for complete healing. Uh, I declare complete healing over you right now in the name of Jesus. Uh, for God, I ask that you fight for them in the name of Jesus. Uh, fight for them, almighty God. Contend with those who contend with them. Uh, let those, almighty God, who persecute them, be, mighty God, be confounded and put to shame. Uh, but they will never be confounded. Uh, let those, almighty God, who try to persecute them, be dismayed. Uh, let them be dismayed and wonder how did it happen but I declare mighty God that father you will rise up and frustrate the plans of the wicked and rise up and frustrate the plans of the wicked in that that, that the hands of the wicked will not succeed against them in the name of Jesus father I pray father sin it is a righteous thing with you God to recompense tribulation to those who trouble them even money that they have my God that they've been spending on legal legal expenses father we pray uh, a, re a re restoration uh, restoration in the name of Jesus so we declare a restoration oh God I ask that you'll show up as their judge and as their jury my God send your angel uh, release and activate your angels almighty God uh, to bring them divine favor uh, to bring them divine almighty God justice in this situation my God send your angels my God to surround them with fire that when they show up before the judge the judge will not see them uh, but the judge will see the fire of God over their lives uh, oh God of mercy my God you are a God of mercy uh, Jehovah Gibor fight for them fight for them uh, fight for them in the court case and fight for them in this situation uh, fight for them Jehovah Gibor uh, Jehovah Gibor I ask that you will fight for them uh, show up for them almighty God uh, be an enemies to their enemies uh, oh my god yes lord uh, let those that come against them will flee before them seven ways in confusion uh, for the lord shall fight for them oh my god uh, let there be an ambush against those that rise up against them uh, i declare that father in the name of jesus uh, my god the enemy my god will be confused uh, yes lord for the lord god will confound those that persecute you uh, yet you will not be confounded the lord will dismay those that dismay you in the name of jesus father i say bring upon them the day of evil and destroy them with double destruction oh god arise and let your enemies be scattered and let those that hate them flee before them as the smoke is driven away so drive them away as the wax melt before the fire so god let the wicked that come up against them perish at your presence so, so when they enter my God in this court situation uh, my God you will show up with them as Jehovah Gibor uh, Jehovah Shama you will be with them uh, Jehovah Shama you will be their God uh, behold they shall gather but God is saying not by me said God uh, for those who gather against you they shall fall for your sake uh, I said those who gather against you in this court battle they shall fall for your sake I pray over you uh, no weapon that is formed against you it shall not prosper and the tongue that rise against you in judgment uh, we condemn it right now come on say I condemn it uh, come on say I condemn in the name of Jesus uh, yes God for it is a righteous thing with you God uh, recompense tribulation to those that trouble them uh, recompense tribulation to the troublemaker that bring almighty oh, God legal case against them uh, recompense tribulation uh, I say you are acquitted you are acquitted we come against the accuser of the brethren we come against the accuser in the name of Jesus we come against the defamers those who defame your name oh God I declare uh, father in the name of Jesus that you restore dignity and honor to their name uh, we remove your name from the system uh, in the name of Jesus we remove your name from the system uh, we declare mighty God we remove your name uh, that you will not have oh mighty God anything uh, that has defamed your name or your character uh, but Lord let your righteousness and integrity preserve them in Jesus name if you have prayed with me in faith, I, I, I just want you to believe that God will do it for you. Share this video, subscribe and share and hit the notification bell as well. So when we go live or we upload a new prayer, you can be notified. Please go ahead and share this.
share this broadcast and know that we have been winning lots of court cases. Just know that God is with you. Fear not. The Bible in Psalms 56 verse 11, it says, I will not be afraid of what man can do unto me. Do not fear man. You have repented. God is on your side and I declare victory is yours today. Victory over you in this situation. You will not have to fight for the Lord said, I will fight for you. God bless you.